Today I'm working on a 2006 BMW 330Ci, replacing the thermostat. Thermostat comes with the housing, this whole plastic assembly all comes together. So, first up, you're going to want to drain the coolant out. There's a couple ways you can do it. There's a uh, the bottom of the radiator, there's actually a, uh, a drain, but sometimes those seize up. If that's fighting you and it doesn't feel as though it wants to come loose nicely, then um, pulling the low radiator hose is another good option. You just remove these metal spring clips, pull that straight up, and then you can just push that away. Uh, if you don't do that, you'll you'll dump um, you know coolant all over your drive belts, and um, you know, that can cause them to squeak or whatever. You know, it's not a good idea. So after you drain it, you're gonna want to um, disconnect this. Uh, plug here and just move it out of the way you can kind of leave it just you know you can move it the best you can but it doesn't there you can just flip it out of the way like that and um, now you can see all your mounting bolts the top two anyways look at your new one you know and it'll help you identify where the lower bolts are but here here and then there's there's two down low. This bracket that goes to the, the lifting hook here, you're gonna have to take this nut off up here so you can remove this bracket because the bracket traps this upper bolt on the uh, thermostat housing. So pull this off, this bolt, this bolt, and then release these spring clips. The way you release these spring clips, you can use a uh, a hook tool like this and get it in here and pull these back until they click and now the uh, now it's now it's free to be released so just put a little bit of tension on it with a screwdriver or something right right here on this edge carefully and with your other hand pull back on the uh, the hose keep a little tension on it and it'll it'll pop right off there so I'm gonna go ahead and pull both of these hoses and um, take those upper bolts bolts off now that those upper bolts are released and the hoses are off, uh, you have to get to the two lower bolts. Looking at the new one will help help you figure out where those are located. Um, you just use a 10 millimeter deep socket. What I like to use is my long quarter inch ratchet along with a, a deep 10 millimeter socket. And you can just fit it right in here and get right to those and um, get those loose. So I'm going to pull those out now, and then the thermostat housing will be ready to come out the top. Alright, now that I grabbed that out of there, the most uh, important thing is make sure this ceiling surface is clean. Um, I like to use this one's actually not bad at all it's you can see that there's not a whole lot of corrosion and, the, and it looks pretty good sometimes you'll see them where they're pitted on the ceiling surface if that's the case you, you may have to after you clean it real well if you know you may have to put some kind of a sealant on it but um, if the surface is clean like it should be and it's flat and you don't see a lot of pitting it, it should just you should just be able to bolt this bolt this on and you'll be good so I'm gonna use a little bit of a scuff pad here.